drive. To overcome obstacles. I believe I could be very successful. It allowed me to focus more on my academics. I'm grateful for my scholarship because I wouldn't be able to come to New York and study at John Jay College. Stipend was immensely helpful to me. I mean, I was working full time um, in retail, and I, I'm a mom, and so and I was paying out of pocket a lot of the my school expenses. As an out-of-state student, it's very hard to pay my tuition, and without the help of the aid of my scholarships, I probably wouldn't be able to attend John Jay. My father, Arthur B. Hill, was an early master's graduate of John Jay. And the Arthur and Patricia Hill Foundation have funded an internship and launching in fall 2015, a fellowship in honor of my father, Arthur B. Hill. I have been delighted in everything I've learned about the, the student population here at John Jay. It's a large immigrant population, it's a big commuter school, so people often have to work and go to school at the same time. I received the Arthur B. Hill Scholarship um, because of my NYPD internship. I come from a single parent household, um, certainly way below the economic standards. So I applied for the scholarship to kind of offset my academic expenses. So I think it's very important to honor those effort, efforts and to ensure that the diversity we have here at John Jay is represented in our police forces and in law enforcement agencies across the country. I'm well aware that there are so many youngsters in this world who cannot afford to go to college if we're not for scholarships. I've had the opportunity and the privilege of sponsoring the Art and Justice program, which is a new program, just a year old, at John Jay. I found this would be a dimension in the lives of the young people learning here that would be very important over time. The Art and Justice Fellowship here at John Jay has given me a unique opportunity to basically interact with art that's socially and politically charged. I guess the best answer to why I was inspired to start these fellowships is that um, I came to realize later in my life how important art was. And I knew reasonably well what was going on at John Jay in terms of educating youngsters and so many other specialties, but I thought this was lacking. And it's really consistent with what my late wife and I did uh, in many educational institutions. We're great believers of education and we sponsored many programs in the arts. So I've always wanted to work at the Studio Museum of Harlem because the Studio Museum of Harlem kind of levels the playing field. Um, it deals with uh, African-American artists and artists of African descent um, and gives them a platform in the art world. And I really feel that I want to get that background. The internship that I'm going to be going into is uh, the Elizabeth Foundation um, for the Arts. I have that kind of dynamic uh, interaction with the outside world um, and having kind of this first step into the real world, what it's like to be in this kind of different art communities, I think um, is something that's really rich. I can't believe that even being at John Jay, you know, that I'm gonna, <laughs> John Jay, which is a criminal justice school, I'm here in this art program, you know, I too get a chance to, you know, intern at a place like the Studio Museum of Harlem. I'm beyond appreciative. <laughs> I'm grateful for my scholarship because without it, I don't think I would have ever come to John Jay. As a matter of fact, I don't think I've ever, I would have ever come to college. Uh, it's truly opening up my future. I'm grateful for my scholarship because it gave me the tools I needed to really take what I had was an idea and really put it into fruition and apply the tools that they gave me into real life. Shukran. Thank you. Thank you. Gracias por darme esta oportunidad. I would do it all over again if I could.